Plateau State Police Commissioner Dikpo Ayeni has warned the Birums and Fulanis in Riom local government area of the state to sheathe their swords and embrace dialogue rather than engage in unnecessary killing and destruction of property. The police commissioner, while addressing elders and representatives of those communities at the police headquarters in Jos, emphasized the readiness of security agents to handle any problem. Will the people of Plateau State be able to sleep with their eyes closed? That's the assurance the community leaders gave during the meeting. Surrender your arms. The police boss, obviously tired of bombs going off, calls this the final warning. He's waving the white flag first by inviting grey hairs of these hot spots to the police headquarters in Plateau State to dialogue before he lets loose his venom on all the troublemakers that will go against this order. One of the reasons where this crisis has lingered on for so much is that people we lost people's cow, no arrest, they will get away. People will kill and maim and destroy houses and burn houses. Only few arrests we made. This is a very strong appeal to all of you. Somebody is about the arms. Come and give me the name of that person and the address. And it seems all the talk is falling on fertile ground as representatives of the warring factions agree to bury the hatchet. We and the leadership of the Biram and the leadership of the Fulani, we have to sit and fish out toast that are problems in our society. Any Biram that have seen a Fulani person committing a crime or a Fulani seen a Biram committing a crime, really he have seen him not because they have a personal problem, he should forward his name to us or through the security for prosecution. The first solution is that people who are, who are taking the laws into their hands and list of suspects, they should be apprehended. If found guilty, the law should take its course. If we can sit down and talk together, that like the case was before, that will be the beginning of peace in this state. A peace committee is also in the works. But away from the chart room, the true test of this meeting is for all the parties involved to be able to walk the talk. And that means no guns and bombs. No.